If a pilot needs to go out just to go to the toilet, for example, uh, then the door is locked. When that pilot wants to come back in, they enter in a, a code on a pad, uh, and then that buzzes in the cockpit, and the person in the cockpit then lets them in. So it's a request, effectively. Now, there is a system, if that doesn't work, there's also cameras, by the way, so that the pilot can see who's outside. Uh, there is a system to override that at an, um, in emergencies, for example, if the person on the flight deck has become ill, has had a heart attack, or is unconscious, or something like that. We don't tend to go into details of what that system is, because for obvious reasons. We don't want to tell everybody. But there is a way that the pilot outside, theoretically, can override the system and get in through that door. Um, so, in theory, it shouldn't happen. Even if there's a pilot alone and ill on the cockpit, in the cockpit, the other person should still be able to get in. And we know that... This plane took around 10 minutes to dive and hit the ground. So that is a long time. That is a long time to go through this whole procedure and try to get into the cockpit.